Hey loves, welcome to my channel. My name is Naya. My Instagram is crownhervixen and my business is Her Vixen Wigs. I've just recently launched this month my own brand, as I mentioned before, Her Vixen Wigs. Um, so I'm gonna be doing like uh, wig videos as far as get ready with me, styling the wigs that are on my website that I offer. Um, also doing like, um, like mini hair tutorials and also I want to do entrepreneur vlogs or related type of videos so shout out to Kyla Shea here on YouTube she does like entrepreneur vlogs um, my entrepreneur type of vlogs will be inspired by the type of videos or niche that I feel like she's kind of um, put a spotlight here on YouTube um, but I have a a wig brand so I feel like I can offer some entrepreneur vlogs that will be uh, quite different and give you even more of an insight of you know an entrepreneur that is in more of the hair industry as opposed to she sells like lashes and jewelry I believe so yeah today's video my shirt is unraveling uh, sis sis that's that's the Lord telling me to stop being a thought okay <laughs> Um, excuse my background, I am in my daughter's room. I have an eight month old. I do have a maternity uh, vlog that's up. You should definitely check that out. That was super lit. But I'm in her um, bedroom, but a portion of her bedroom, it's like a corner of her bedroom is my studio. So that's why I'm recording in here and I'm in front of a really big window. So that works as well. Anyways, so um, in this vlog, I am basically just going to be doing an unboxing with you guys for my um, custom made boxes for my website. So I'm super excited about that. Anytime my customers purchase a wig, it will be coming in this custom made box. So right now I'm showing you guys and I'll show you guys this more up close. But um, this is like a sample of the box. Um, but as you can see, this really big box next to me is full of um, a bunch more. I think I ordered 50. So we're going to be doing an unboxing. I probably shouldn't have shown you the box first. But I'm going to show you guys this up close. And I'm also going to give you guys the vendor that I use for my custom boxes. So if you sell bundles frontals, wigs, you could definitely use the same vendor. I don't mind sharing that with you. Um, before I do an unboxing, ooh, girl, I was on my knees and that's starting to hurt, child. What I offer on my website is customers can provide their own bundles. So this is a box that a customer of mine let me keep. And this is um, a box, it says elvahairwigs.com. I don't know I'm not too sure I don't know if this is like an AliExpress brand um, based off of like their wording on the back I could tell it's kind of like a Chinese based brand but um, I just wanted to I asked her could I keep the box so I could get the measurements for the box because I really hate how it is on Instagram but like I was reaching out to some uh, some stylists on Instagram who have like you know a K behind their uh, following and they have a large following I wasn't asking like hey who's your box vendor who do you get your boxes from like I was just simply asking like hey like I'm looking for my own box vendor but I was just wondering if you could give me like do you know what your usual measurements are for your boxes like I like how the uh, the size of their boxes look and a lot of them would mark, a few of them that I reached out to would just mark my messages as read and not respond. Which, like, I just kind of feel like, I don't know, like, why do we have to be like that? Um, like, once again, I wasn't asking for your vendor. I wasn't asking who did the graphics of the box. Like, I'm just asking for the measurements. If you don't know the measurements, it's just that you don't know the measurements. But just mark me as read, like, so I got y'all. Um... So anyway, she let me keep the box. I got a measuring tape because I use a measuring tape to make my wigs. And I got the specs of the box. Um, now that I have my boxes, it's not exactly spot on. Um, I think the website I got my boxes just showed an example of this box. And I knew it would be perfect for the wigs. So I didn't even go off of the true measurements. But I just want to show you the quality difference of the boxes. 
Now there is, um, you can use this website as well. It's a website called papermart.com. They sell custom made boxes. I feel like this brand, I don't know where they got their boxes made, but I feel like the quality of these boxes are the type of boxes that Paper, Might, Paper Mart would offer. So as you can see, it's kind of, it's not a bad box by any means. Like Paper Mart is, I believe, cheaper than my vendor. Um, but you can see it's kind of softer. Um, she tore through the box, but you can see that it can definitely tear. Um, and everything like that. They offer um, like some pamphlets and manuals and stuff like that. You could offer that inside of your boxes as well. Or, you know, I want to offer something sturdy because if this is going through the mail, like they're just throwing this around, I could see this arriving. Like it's possible, especially around the holidays and stuff. This could arrive to your customers really like beat up and wrinkled and I don't want you to be able to tear the box like I want you to be able to receive your wig and low-key I want you to be able to keep your wig inside the box now I'm showing you the quality of this box which is not bad like I said I believe papermark.com the quality of their boxes like as as far as it being soft like this I feel it's gonna it's gonna be pretty similar to this type of box my vendor Do you hear that? This, they can throw this around through uh, FedEx, USPS, whatever. They can throw this around and it's, it's sturdy. You can't bend into this. It's a really sturdy box. It's still made of cardboard material, but it's very sturdy. It's really good quality. Um, my logo, I made my logo myself. If you guys want me to do a video on that, I can. It's pretty simple. Typey Image has like this gold type of foil material. You could check that out. Um, on the back, it just has my uh, website, HerVixenWigs.com. It has a uh, tag her vixen wigs to be featured. You definitely want to use hashtags for your brand. And it has my Instagram, hervixenwigs.com. As you can see here, this is not something that could just be ripped or torn open. You would peel it open like this. And then you have the inside of the box. I put like a little saying inside of the box. I didn't take advantage of my money because it doesn't make a difference in price on whether you like feel every corner of this box with color or print or text and I made a mistake and I forgot to fill this in as black I mean it doesn't look terrible it's just white moving forward I would have black in the inside as opposed to just having this white but if even if you don't have a hair brand you may sell clothing um, Clothing, I don't I don't know what else. <laughs> Anything that would need a box like this, you could still use that merchant. You don't just have to use this for a hair brand, but of course I feel like it's a kind of like a standard thing to have boxes now for a hair brand. So here they are. I'm probably not gonna actually unbox every single one on camera, but when you take it out of the box, this is what it looks like. It comes flat. You can assemble it very easily by yourself. And while I'm over here doing this, um, the vendor, their name is boxup.com. Boxup.com. So here's my boxes. I'm going to show y'all once again up close. So it has my logo. I wanted to go for a simple look. If you have a photo shoot for your hairline, you could have like the photo. I've seen some girls like have like their models wearing the hair. Like I just wanted to do like a simple sleek box with just a simple text logo. But you could put any pictures or graphics anywhere on any panel of the box. My brand has like this gold and white marble. Um, so I have that on the sides. And 
I have it on the back once again with my information you can set this up any way that you want and then I just have like my brand statement um, inside of the box so it's really lit but hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog if you guys want to see any more entrepreneur vlogs any additional vendor information or anything else I share with you guys as like some business behind the scenes I'll definitely um, upload more let me know if you guys want to see with the app that I use how I created my own logo and how I actually did the graphics I'm just gonna show you like a quick little a snippet of how you can actually go in and virtually design your box I'm not going to show you step by step how I design mine but if you want to know how I do my graphics and my logos make sure you guys let me know down below in the comments and if you guys enjoyed this video make sure that you guys subscribe also make sure you check out my website hervixenwigs.com we offer full lace wigs completely customized lace frontals I've got you um, but yeah, definitely check us out and check out our social media handles. I'll have that all down below in the description. YouTube changes it around all the time, but I believe it's down below. Make sure y'all check that out. Alright, and I'll see y'all in my next video.